<laughs> that didn't work. Hey everybody, what's going on? So of course, I got plans today, but my plans got sidetracked. You know why? Because my young lad got his car stuck late last night or early this morning, and I had to go help him. But I'm supposed to be meeting some guys over at the ATV park. Made it! We're gonna do some trail maintenance and probably play around in the snow log just a little bit because we had a big snowstorm last night. Whoo! So like I was saying before, we had this huge snowfall last night, started about 10 o'clock and it friggin' came down. Yeah, so my young lad sends me a text in the middle of the night, didn't see it till 6 a.m. this morning. Oh, we're going off the road and we're stuck. So I had to go help him out this morning. I don't know about you, but I've been watching me some Matt's off-road recovery. I got him out. I met up with three other lads. Devin and the other guy I met once. I don't remember the other guy's names. <laughs> I forget, sorry. We just cleared up a few trees. Make this a little better. This is a pretty bad trail, so I've been always going to this side, but we made it a little nicer for everybody to go by. I don't want to go down the middle up here because we're going to break through. I'll try to avoid that. That was interesting. I think I had a spot where we need to clear the trail a little bit better. <laughs> Look at the gook I got on my freaking pants. Jeez. Yeah, I think we could make this a little nicer, I think, and we're good. Yeah. Back 
sure was windy. So we continued clearing trails for a while, and we discovered clearing trails right after a snowstorm, not a great idea. And just as we finish up, these two young lads on Honda show up, and the one guy just goes for this one spot. We were completely surprised. Good. Well, that's just it, yeah? Like, it's a little lighter, right? We're just sending her right through there with that old Honda. Oh, that's yeah. another gear. <laughs> yeah. A little Han dude's out on the trail. Let right, him go. Han dude. There you go, lads. You got the outlaws on there. They were good tires. So we were done clearing trails for the day. The plan was to head back to Devin's place, drop off the chainsaws, and go do some trail ripping. I'm gonna break through right there. about you but after getting off the trails and hitting the road there's this natural instinct to just want to open it up Someone's gonna break. 
we had nothing to worry about. <laughs> That's awesome. Wheel is just going all by themselves. <laughs> That's freaking hilarious. I gotta get that. Your hole, your tire got down this hole over here, and that's where I got stuck in. We broke through. Oh yeah. Sucker. Yeah. I'm doing three kilometers an hour. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty hilarious. Yeah, yeah you're kind of hung up there, bud. Mm -hmm. Three wheel drive. <laughs> can't be that strong but it's freaking tough Ten feet of width, though. <laughs> How do you keep getting stuck? Don't need much. <laughs> this, yeah, this might not work. <laughs> That's funny.
belt go down. <laughs> That's a lot of fun. Yeah, it is friggin' right. I'd rather than a four wheeler than a snowmobile. Like, oh, and this? Friggin' right, man. Wow, that certainly was an interesting day. <laughs> we got some trail maintenance done. Happy about that. We didn't do a whole lot, but we're gonna have to go back for a few more times. But you can't work all the time and not play. With the snow that we had ripping through these trails was awesome. And you never know what's gonna happen on any given ride. Like seriously, we stopped here for a break, uh, splitting off with the guys so I could drive home and they could, the other guys could head back to Devin's place. The guys go to leave and Buddy's four wheel drive is not working on the Kawasaki. Like what's up with that? And then it started to work for a minute and then it quit again. That's not good. But now your front, your front drive not working. There's nothing like a good fresh snowfall to have fun on your Renegade. And I gotta tell you, a set of assassinators work real good in this deep snow. Makes me not even want to have a snowmobile. Now, sleds are a lot of fun in the right conditions. You know what I'm saying? All right, I gotta make some tracks. I gotta get home, gotta get supper on. Thanks so much for watching. I couldn't do it without you guys. But if you really want to help me out, there's two things you can do. One, go to my website, adventureswithisway.com, buy some merch, that'd be awesome. So after you order up some merch, go and watch this awesome mud riding video at the ATV park right now. Cheers.